The heart pumps blood into the arteries by alternative contraction and relaxation. As a result, the pressure arises within the arteries known as blood pressure. The blood pressure is measured with a blood pressure cuff and is recorded as systolic and diastolic. The systolic pressure is the pressure following the contraction of the heart. The diastolic pressure is the pressure while the heart is in the relaxation phase. The normal systolic pressure is 120. The normal diastolic pressure is 80. The blood pressure is considered high when the systolic pressure is higher than 140 and the diastolic pressure above 90. The blood pressure is not constant and frequently varies depending on the posture, activities and stress. For proper evaluation of the blood pressure, several readings are needed, noted over a period of a couple of months. Although high blood pressure can be caused by a medical condition, while in most cases the underlying cause is unknown. Overweight, excessive salt intake, drinking more than two cups of alcohol per day constitute the risk of getting high blood pressure. A healthy lifestyle can be a great contribution towards prevention of high blood pressure. Abstinence from smoking prevents damage to your cardiovascular system. Have less than two alcoholic drinks per day. Take a balanced diet, avoid overeating, excessive salt and fat. Have a daily intake of fruits, vegetables and dairy products. Physical exercise, relaxation and fun prevent stress and positively affect your blood pressure. Some families are more prone to high blood pressure than others. High blood pressure itself is not a disease. However, consistently high blood pressure for many years increases the risk of heart and coronary diseases. The occurrence of cardiovascular disorders in close relatives increases your own risk of high blood pressure. Smoking and diabetes affect the cardiovascular system more than high blood pressure. You are advised to have your blood pressure checked by your general practitioner. When you are over 40 and your blood pressure has never been measured before, when immediate family members have had a cardiovascular disease, when you are experiencing heart and vascular problems, when you have already been diagnosed with high blood pressure, your general practitioner can give you more information about the disorder and possible treatment options.